guys welcome back to my channel I know it's been a while but I am back with another video and I am so happy to post it oh my god life has just been you know getting in the way but we gonna get these videos out regardless because we boss bitch okay I need to stop anyway so first I'm just gonna start by moisturizing my face and I'm gonna use the black radiance primer also I really 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 like this primer and I'm gonna be going in on the eyes first I don't know when I do eyeshadow lately I just been starting with the eyes first just in case I mess up it's just easier to wipe off instead of like doing a full face and then um, messing my ish up so I don't know I just like to do eyeshadow first and then do everything else and I feel like it comes together that way for this tutorial I will be using the Anastasia Beverly Hills palette I barely use this palette and it is one of my favorite palettes but it's just like on an everyday basis I'm not wearing eyeshadow but if I was to do it I would be doing this look I'm just gonna take a few colors from there and create a very simple look I started with some brown transition shades and now I'm going in with these like reddish tones that I really 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 like in the palette I'm just gonna focus that on the crease of my eye and really just blend that and I'm gonna deepen it also with one of the browns in the palette this is super easy I only used about three eyeshadows so like I just wanted to make this tutorial really simple and something that you could literally wear on an everyday basis so yeah the video is pretty self-explanatory um, I'm just gonna of course take that silvery shade and focus it in the middle and then blend it out again with my blending brush that came with the palette actually and I do like this brush like I always 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 reach for this brush when I use this palette as well and when I'm done with that, I'm just going to go on to the rest of the face. I'm adding my foundation. And as you can tell, I did do my eyebrows off camera because it was such a hassle. But um, I'm also going to be using one of the silvery shadows from the palette on the brow of my arch. <laughs> Oh my god, on the brow of my arch? What the hell am I talking about? I need to lay off the, the weed. Like, really? Really? Brow of my arch? You know what? Let's just act like I didn't say that. Now I'm going to focus my attention to the rest of my face. I like to mix this Maybelline concealer with the Fawn concealer. I feel like it gives me that right amount of brightness. So I'm just going to mix those two together, blend it out. And I don't know if you guys noticed by now, but I like to blend one side of my face out and um, set it with powder first and then do the other side. I feel like when I do my makeup that way, it doesn't crease. Like every time I try to do both at the same time, it's always creasing. So I feel like when I do it that way, it helps to not crease, at least for me. So that's the method I've been using. I'm also going to start contouring a little bit. Um, I don't really go too hammy on the contour. I just want something that's really soft and natural. And to go over that, I am going to use this foundation. Actually, this is not foundation. This is compact powder. I love MAC Mineralize. Like, I will never, ever ever stop using MAC Mineralize. It makes your skin look so freaking smooth. It's like a baby's bottom, literally. It's so smooth, like, ugh. I just, I don't know. I'll never stop buying this. But anyways, I am gonna start highlighting with Wet n Wild. I never, ever, 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 ever in my life bought a Wet n Wild highlighter. And this one right here is crazy it's so bomb I love this I'm gonna use it on my cheeks I'm gonna use it on the inner corner of my eye like I'm just gonna put it all over the place because that deserves some love and then last but not least I'm just gonna add some lipstick I did like three different lipsticks I'm not even gonna lie to you I'm always using Honey Love by MAC, I'm always using Cork li Lip Pencil, so I know that's what I used. And I also use this Butter Gloss by NYX, and it's so freaking bomb. I love all their butter glosses. But anyway guys, that is about it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you on my next video. I will be posting. I'm not even, don't even hold me to it, to be honest. I ain't, I ain't shit. <laughs> Bye guys.